Hello YouTube and welcome back and today we are going to be looking at a toast or snack bar example okay so before we get into the example I just want to make a quick announcement um, if you haven't seen the featured video on the channel uh, I want to like you know remind you guys that make sure you subscribe to this channel because uh, we will be running uh, some of the uh, swags and giveaways free giveaways and uh, we're gonna be handing out uh, coupons to our courses free coupons free courses we have like a whole bunch of courses on iOS in Udemy and uh, we want to give you guys like you know an opportunity to go in there and uh, learn uh, basically the full length uh, uh, features uh, using Udemy so uh, we're gonna be running those uh, pretty soon so I would actually encourage you to uh, subscribe to this channel and uh, uh, click on the bell icon before you leave or before you start this channel so please do it right now alright cool so let's get into the uh, into the tutorial alright so what we're gonna be building today is uh, this uh, toast example and uh, basically uh, when you click on this uh, we're gonna show user a toast and uh, this could be like you know a simple alert or, or something has been saved or a message has been sent uh, basically something in that nature you must have seen like you know in, in Gmail where like you know sometime when you archive your mail uh, you see a, a toast message uh, that's, that lets you do uh, undo and it disappears after a few seconds so uh, that is a toast and we're going to be building that in flutter from scratch all right so one more time if you click on click on this button it shows the toast you click on undo it hides it if you click on toast and leave it like there uh, it's gonna stay there for a while and then it's gonna hide itself all right so let's go ahead and get started I have literally nothing I mean there's something in there but like you know it's almost nothing so I've got I've already imported uh, my material dot art I've got main function right here and it's expecting a my app uh, app to be written so we're gonna use one of the template and we create stateless uh, template uh, from the template like stateless class like that and we're gonna name this one my app like so okay with this, uh, we're gonna say we're gonna remove the container, and uh, we're gonna say we wanna build a material app, and we're gonna have home, and home is gonna be another calling another class home. Now, usually you do it in another file, but I'm gonna do it just for sake of simplicity, like you know, showing everything in one place. I'm just gonna do it at the bottom of the file right here. Okay, so class. Let's, let's not type. Let's use template. Uh, stateless. Okay. Home. There we go. Alright. We're going to get rid of this. And uh, we're going to put our scaffold in place. Okay. Then app bar. Then title for the app bar. What are you going to say? We're going to say toast snack bar it's also known as snack bar well Google calls it snack bar that's all the classes are defined um, so that's what you're calling snack bar I'm gonna create a builder and this builder is gonna provide us the context okay and uh, we're gonna say we're gonna use center basically we're gonna center our button uh, on the center of this at the center of the screen so child and we're gonna have a raised button in here and this raised button is gonna have a text child show toast like so and on press it's gonna do something so you're gonna call another function show toast there we go and we're gonna supply our context in there okay for this we are separating our logic that actually shows text shows toast uh, in a separate function so let's do that okay so we're gonna make some room down here and uh, we're gonna create a void function builder context context and 
and uh, then I'm gonna get the scaffold using context so scaffold of context there we go that's why we were passing the context and then we're gonna say scaffold dot show snack bar okay and we're gonna initialize snack bar here there we go content is going to be a text let's call this one snack bar not toast okay this is a, this is a snack bar action that you can take on this is a snack bar action and label we're going to provide the label undo if you want to do undo something and on press we can say scaffold dot hide current snack bar okay and with that we are ready to rock and roll so let's go ahead and let me stop the old app and restart there you go it's launching and the build process is kicking in all right there we go so build is done it took eight seconds to build and now we have our app being installed and launched now okay all right okay there we go so we have our um we have our uh, app ready and a very simple app just to show you like you know how toast works so show toast and this is a snack bar voila click undo it hides it show toast one more time wait for a minute or a few seconds and it's gonna hide itself all right so this is it for uh this video now don't forget to uh subscribe and Click on that bell icon uh, to basically receive the notification whenever we upload a new video and uh, get ready for some of the giveaways. Okay, thank you guys.